Hey, this is Nathan from Sound Iron. Today I'm going to walk you through my composition for Sonosphere's Limitless. This is a collection of all four Sonosphere's libraries. We've got Distance, Origins, Current, and Direction wrapped in a new GUI with additional features and controls. Let's go ahead and hear what this sounds like. Everything you just heard came from Sonosphere's Limitless. No additional samples were used. Now we'll break it down track by track. So the first track is using a preset that Blake made called the Asimov. And this is from the Blake Ewing custom presets. So you've got the start here, cheat codes, underscore, movement, melodic, bass, and experimental. And that'll get you started. And then the Sound Iron custom presets have arps, effects, leads, and pads. So Asimov is right here. And you can see it's using Sonospheres 1 in this layer, Sonospheres 2 in this layer, 3 in this layer, and 4 in this layer. But you could easily switch that if you wanted to just use Sonospheres 1 in every layer or mix and match. And then the effects rack is using delay, plate reverb, and tape saturation. So if you wanted to hear more of the ARP, you could switch to that layer and then turn the volume up, or you could switch to the XY pad and you could make sure that the macros are controlling uh, left and right X fade and TB X fade. And then as this moves, you've got the volume increasing in each corner. So in the middle, it's equal volume for all four layers. This is a preset called Videotape, and I'm using this track as the bass and it's using Sonospheres 4 in every layer. This one is called Precipice. This one is the videotape preset again, but I'm using it as like a lead melodic instrument. So I turned off the tape saturation and brought the drive down on the scream or something. This preset is called Distant, and it's panned a little bit to the right. And this one is Effervescent Dance, and it's panned to the left. This one is called Breath of Air.
And my favorite part about this library is that you can quickly make your own hybrid instruments and new sounds by just clicking the random button and then hearing what the part plays. The next several tracks are Percussion from the Field Kit and Impacts. And then I've got Valhalla Delay, Ghost, Falling Snare on all of it. And that wraps up my composition for Sonosphere's Limitless. If you'd like to take a closer look, you can download the Reaper file and MIDI file in the description below. Please subscribe here for more videos like this, and we'll talk to you soon.